BC Disability Assistance Rates PWD, are still thousands of dollars below the poverty line in 2021. BC PWD, deep in poverty. A year's income at 2022 BC PWD rates for single persons is roughly $16,300. The poverty rate for Canada is approximately $26,000 for a single person. Persons on BC Disability Assistance receive $375 a month for shelter. The average monthly rent in BC is over $2,000. The Monthly Canada Emergency Response Benefit, CERB, based on a minimum standard of living, was $2,000, much more than the $1,358 monthly provincial disability rate for a single person. Despite these minuscule disability rates, disabled persons actually have higher living costs than non-disabled persons. As a result, Persons on BCPWD disproportionately face poverty and ongoing debt, homelessness and tenuous shelter, starvation and malnutrition, inability to pay for much needed medications, depression and mental health issues. BC's Human Rights Commission stated that disabled persons are falling through the cracks in BC and aren't having their economic rights sufficiently protected. How increasing BCPWD helps by increasing BCPWD monthly payments to $1,800, BCPWD rates would finally be brought up to Canada's poverty line, so that persons on BC disability assistance would better be able to meet basic needs instead of choosing between essentials like food, medication, rent, and utilities. For example, people on BCPWD would have a greater ability to contribute to local businesses and economic rebuilding, avoid homelessness and access safe shelter and housing, prevent starvation and malnutrition, afford life-saving medication and therapy, buy suitable clothes for themselves and their children, avoid being forced to choose between which bills to pay, break out of poverty and debt cycles, improve their mental health. In an interview with BC Disabilities Spencer Van Lotten, increasing disability assistance was the first thing housing expert Brian Clifford identified as being vital to providing respectable housing for disabled persons. Oh, but they should just get a job. This is sometimes mentioned in response to calls for raising BCPWD rates, but it's not a suitable response for a few reasons. Many people on BC Disability Assistance can't work, which is why they're on disability. Even if someone on BCPDW can work a limited number of hours, when they're struggling so much to get by how are they going to find the time, resources, or energy to develop employment skills or to send out 30 applications a day when they're struggling just to eat or find shelter? Jobs are very tough to find for anyone, let alone disabled persons who face discrimination in hiring raising BCPWD actually helps the economy in general, as persons with disabilities would have more money to spend at local businesses what you can do to increase BCPWD sign the BCPWD petition if you do not want persons with disability to live in poverty, please add your support to our petition to increase disability assistance sign the BCPWD petition read and share BCPWD stories read and share first hand accounts about the struggle of living on BCPWD rates. If you are comfortable, please share your own story.